Hey everyone, Jenny Lin here. And here I have the amazingly talented Lisa Marie Holmes. Today we are so excited to be chatting about our brand new collection with Lisa Marie. We picked five really beautiful, rich earth tone colors, and they're actually all herbs that I use in my medicinal apothecaries. Why don't we talk about each one and just let me know that inspiration of where each color really came from yeah. and what it means. I guess we can start with lavender. Lavender is a fun one. When I see the lavender paint color next to my lavender herb, it actually resonates and there's a beautiful symmetry there that you really pulled through those natural lavender tones from and the I plant. Think you're thinking very French provincial mm -hmm. lavender too. Absolutely. Super pretty and yeah. soft and I think just what the collection needs. Enchanted Echinacea is such a beautiful, I just love the name. I like saying Enchanted <laughs> Echinacea. It has this mysticism and magic about it. Echinacea truly is a magical plant. So Echinacea is really great for boosting the immune system and actually helps boost the production of hyaluronic acid. So hyaluronic acid is naturally produced by the body and it actually helps keep the cells together and really tight. So you can actually improve your skin health. I love that and I have to say, I think this is going to be one of my absolute new favorite mm -hmm. colors. Mm -hmm. It is just the perfect soft rustic rose color. Yeah, yeah. I'm loving it. Yeah, we actually got the inspiration from the echinacea from not the petals themselves, but from the heart of the echinacea herb. It's very vintage and very mm -hmm. European old world yes. feeling. And then next we have sacred sage. You know, records of sage being used can date back to the ancient Egyptians and Roman and Greek times. But the soft tone of the sage, oh my gosh, mm -hmm. the sage is such a beautiful, it's muted, really gentle. Calming. Yeah. So I think when people think of sage, they may think of green. Think of green, mm -hmm. but think of a really soft, muted, right. with a gray undertone. I definitely see the gray undertone. Mm -hmm. When you take a photo of the paint next to the sage herb, you can actually see that it's quite gray mm -hmm. by nature. Twilight Geranium is a very special mm -hmm. color. It is one that so many fusion fans have been asking for for a long time. It's an incredibly rich, deep plum purple. Mm -hmm. Tell me a little bit about it. Yeah, so Geranium is such a beautiful herb to work with medicinally. But just from an aesthetics perspective, geranium has this beautiful purple hue. And so the reason we called it twilight geranium is because the paint color that we ended up going with is actually a really dark purple. I can only imagine what geranium would look like in a field, a full moon shining up above at twilight. Goddess ashwagandha is just amazing. Tell me a little bit more about it. I am so happy with how the paint color turned out. It really does capture the essence of the ashwagandha. And it's this beautiful, soft, off-white mm -hmm. color. When I think of the plant itself and the, the power that it possesses, we actually use the root of ashwagandha for medicine. So it's an adaptogenic herb, which means that ashwagandha helps pick you up and lift your spirits to be a bit more adapted to life's everyday stresses. It just sounds so beautiful and how you're talking about how therapeutic yeah. ashwagandha is mm -hmm. and working with this paint, I think you're just going to feel great overall. Yeah. It's beautiful. Yeah, <laughs> it's really beautiful. We really hope that you're inspired just as much as we are by these beautiful colors, all inspired by the Spring Homes Herbal Infusions.